How do you expect to get website traffic if you don't have website SEO tools? SEO is one of the keys to getting traffic to your website. And so today's video is about using the best SEO tools to rank your business. I'm gonna share the top 10 tools that I use. So we're gonna jump right into it. Let's roll. Hey guys, my name is Adrian Boisel, and today I wanna to share this training with you on the top 10 SEO tools you need to generate traffic, rank your website, rank your blog, and create a significant amount of traffic through what we call search engine optimization. Hopefully you've watched my previous videos. If you haven't, I would go back and watch the whole series of SEO videos that we did. You can hit the link, I'm gonna drop a link up top. But this is an important video for anybody that's a graphic designer, freelancer, any, or any business owner in general, because I'm gonna share my favorite tools, the tools that we rely on as a company to scale and grow our clients. I'm opening up the doors, I'm pulling away the veil, and I wanna show you guys everything that I'm doing. All right, so let's jump into it. Number one is Hrefs. If you don't know what Hrefs is, it's a really neat site, but it's kinda of hard to figure out the spelling or even pronounce. It's a really short name, it's A-H-R-E-F-S, Hrefs, A-H-R-E-F-S. And that site is an SEO tool that allows you to create rank tracking, allows you to see your backlinks, allows you to see your domain authority, your page authority, the keywords that you're ranking for, where you're at, what your growth is. There's a lot of tools and features that Hrefs offers. And this is a tool that I heavily rely on for all of my SEO optimization. I can't live without that tool. It is a very expensive tool, but it's just part of the cost of doing business. If you're a designer and you're trying to rank your business, web designer, motion designer, graphic designer, you're trying to rank, you need to have the best tools to be able to do that. And there is no better tool than Hrefs. There's some other ones out there that are competitors to it, but I'm picking this one for no other reason than it's always been reliable for me and I haven't had any problems. So that's number one. Number two is sign up. I've talked about this in the past. I've done videos in the past about sign up. Sign up is a tool that allows you to submit your business and your location to the directories, all of the main directories. There are some competitors out there for them as well, but I choose sign up because of the customer service and also the amount of features that they have. They have review generation, rank tracking, which I have found to not be the most reliable in terms of rank tracking, but there are some other features and other even kind of premium directory listings that you can even buy additionally from their free ones that come with the membership. So this is a really great tool. It allows you to do a lot of awesome things in order to rank your business, track your business, get your business on all the directories. If you ever need to change out any info, you change it there and it changes it on all of them for you. So it's gonna save you a ton of time managing clients. And then it'll also send out reports of any changes that you're having in your rankings or any changes to your listings and things that need to be happening. So signups are a really, really great tool. Number three, and this is a go-to for probably any web designer, graphic designer, uh, or motion designer, anybody in general, that they need to know this one, and it's Google Search Console. Google Search Console allows you to track the traffic and the keywords that are coming to your website. It allows you to create a site map. It allows you to make sure you have your robots.txt files. It scans your website for any crawl errors, and it tells you what your average position, how many impressions, and how your website is ranking from the Google perspective. And it's, a, it's gonna be a great tool for you to help create new site maps when you create new pages, submitting your website and having it re-indexed. There's just a lot of settings and features within the Google Search Console that you're gonna need to use to rank your website. So you wanna add your site in there as a directory or as a listing basically inside there so you can start tracking these things. It's pretty quick to set up the tracking code on your website from Search Console. And it all pretty much integrates. You can link Search Console to Google Analytics and back and forth, so it's, it's just a really important tool that you're gonna need to utilize in your business. All right, so number four is Keywords Everywhere. If you haven't heard of this tool before, it's amazing. They actually make a Chrome plugin extension. There may be one for Fire, Firefox as well, but I use Chrome, and inside of the Chrome extension, it automatically shows whenever you do a Google search, all the different keywords on the right-hand side where ads used to be, it shows a bunch of results and it'll actually show all the other keyword variations, what the competition is, and how many, what the search volume is for that and what the average cost per click is. It's a really powerful tool. I think it's owned by Neil Patel. Somebody can correct me if I'm wrong if they wanna drop a comment, but I'm pretty sure that that tool is owned by Neil Patel. But basically you buy credits and then it allows you to do search after search and you're gonna use up those credits. You can pause it like I do when I'm not using it because uh, I don't wanna keep paying for credits for just every everyday searches. So I only turn it on when I'm gonna use it. So it's a really great tool to find good keywords that have a lot of search volume, 
but not a lot of competition. And that's one of the strategies as an SEO person, so you wanna find some of those long tail keywords. I've talked about that in previous videos. Those long tail keywords are gonna really, really help you out. All right, number five is Google's structured data test. You can just go into Google and type in structured data test. It'll be the first thing that shows up there for you. Uh, it's a really powerful tool for you to actually see the structured data, data or the schema markup or the rich snippets. We talked about this on a previous video of how important it is to have the structured data on your website. You can drop your URL in there and see if you have any. If you don't, this is an area that you need to put some attention and focus on from your homepage to all the other pages of your website because structured data is a critical SEO element that is gonna help you have some of those results below your page that's gonna help you rank above people or even show up at the top by having the absolute best information to give to Google, answering specific questions, long tail keyword questions. So you wanna use schema markup, and that is a tool that we use to check the schema markup to make sure that everything is working. Number six, and this is one that I've been using for as long as I've been doing SEO, and I've never done a video on it. I'll probably make a separate video on just this tool alone because there's so many amazing things that it has, but there's a website called smallseo.tools. I'll say it again, small, S as in Sam, E as in Edward, O as in Opera, SEO.tools. It's a really great website. It has plagiarism checkers and backlink checkers and content checkers and there's just dozens. I think there's probably two dozen, three dozen tools on here to help you with your SEO. Very important things. I use this as kind of a staple for me. There's a lot of different features that I use in here. I'm not gonna go in depth to any of those right now, but I wanted to share just the tools that I'm using and why they're important. The amount of tools that you can get on small SEO tools for free and the things that you can do with that is just super, super powerful. And there's not really anything else out there as far as I'm concerned that allows you to do it on a budget like small SEO tools. So check that tool out, check that website out. I think you can even do it from your phone. Um, I don't know if they have an app, but it's a really great website. I do it from my phone all the time and I'm checking things, checking how many backlinks people have, things like that. So that's just another good, good tool to use. Number seven is Authority Builders. This website is actually owned by Matt Diggity. He's got an amazing content on his website. He's invested into a bunch of different softwares, but he's fairly recently launched authority.builders. And that is where you can get backlinks or link juice. This is a really important one. If you haven't done this or you're not doing this for your business, this is something that you really need to start considering is getting backlinks from reputable websites linking back to your website. This will move the needle very quickly for you. A lot of people go out and buy really cheap backlinks that are garbage from really spammy websites. This is the thing and type of things that you want to avoid. I don't want you to do that. So I want you to go to a little bit more of a pricey tool, but it's authority.builders. Authority.builders is gonna get you the best absolute links you can find. You're gonna be able to have a nice dashboard and you're gonna be tying yourself in and supporting a business owner that's really doing incredible things in the SEO world and you can learn a lot from him. So buying into his software, supporting him, you're gonna make your money 10 times over. You can trust me on that. I'm not being paid to say this. I just really believe in what Matt Diggity is doing. He's an amazing guy. He's one of my mentors, people that I've been following for a very long time in the SEO world. So I wanted to share that tool. It's kind of one of the insider secrets right now for people that are very high up in the SEO world. So check out authority.builders if you really wanna rank your website quickly. That's gonna be your best way to go. Number eight, the one and only Yoast. If you haven't heard of Yoast, then you're probably not on WordPress. WordPress is a tool and a website platform that we use more often than anything else because there's so much scalability and customization that we can do. We can make really beautiful websites for an affordable price and it allows us to really create something totally custom. And what I like about it is they have a huge marketplace and the marketplace includes plugins and apps like Yoast. Yoast is an SEO tool that you can incorporate and download into your WordPress website and it walks you through very easily on how to optimize your website. You pick your targeted keyword, you pick your title, you pick your description and it gives you an overall score based on your title, your description and it'll tell you what you need to fix, what you need to do better, if you have enough content, if the layout of your content is good, if it's readable and it just really helps you fine tune your content, your direction, your messaging and your keywords and actually optimizing those individual pages with the on-page SEO. That's gonna be a big tip for you. Use the Yoast tool. It also has the sitemap generator in it. I believe they may even have a robots.txt generator, which is really important as well. I've talked about that in past videos, but Yoast is an awesome plugin. It's the number one plugin we put on every single WordPress website we use. And if you're using a different one, I'd love to hear about it because I'm always looking for new tools. So drop your favorite SEO tool down in the bottom if I didn't mention that here. 
And number nine is Temi or Temi.com, T-E-M-I. This is a great tool that we're using to take all of the videos that I'm making here on YouTube and automatically transcribe them for cheap. It's really affordable to take your videos, upload them there and get them professionally transcribed. And then once they're transcribed, you can go and turn them into articles. So I have a content writer that takes those transcriptions and actually writes them out with the right headers, the right descriptions, and actually makes them into full articles. So this is a tool that's gonna help you create content a lot faster and you're gonna be able to do it very, very affordably. All right, and number 10, and you're probably gonna think I'm having favorites here, but this is another buddy of mine that I just greatly appreciate and support, and I really love his website. I've actually purchased from him myself, so this isn't just me endorsing him to try to give him exposure. This is genuinely me speaking on behalf of what he's doing, is One Click Influence. OneClickInfluence.com, uh, man, this tool is an amazing tool for people that are trying to rank and get influence as well. It's very similar to Authority Builders, but they actually will build a website for you with five articles linking back to other websites for you, like your websites or clients' websites, and this is gonna move the needle very quickly. It's not a cheap service, but it's very effective. You get these websites, everything is hands-off. It's all done for you. You get this beautiful WordPress website. It's pretty much a simple, clean WordPress website, nothing special, but it's a simple, clean WordPress website with a domain name that's already got authority and trust. So check out One Click Influence. These are uh, just an amazing group of people that are actually running this. And it's actually tied back into the job killing group that I've mentioned in the past. So if you don't know what job killing is, I'll make a whole video about that, my journey. But I just really wanted to mention One Click Influence to you guys as number 10. It's a really powerful tool that you can use to skyrocket your growth, skyrocket your influence and your authority online, and really start to get the traffic pumping. So that's what I got for you guys today. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you could please hit that subscribe button, it really tells Google and the like button it tells google and youtube specifically that you love this content so it helps me reach more people so i'd greatly appreciate it i thank you guys for tuning in and spending this time with me today i look forward to seeing you on the next one god bless i'm adrian boysell and as always keep looking up